the well was permitted in 2008, was drilled in 2009, and the operator filed bankruptcy in 2010, unfortunately, uh, before he ever had a chance to put the well online and produce it. So it, the well became abandoned. We took the operator on a series of other leases, was worked through our legal enforcement process, and once they've been all the way through the process and given their day in court, then the well comes back to the state to plug it with state funds. Uh, funds that are furnished by the industry. We use the industry's money to do this, and that's where we are now. The well has been cited as one that needs to be plugged. It's been prioritized, and today we're out here with our contractor plugging it. Each well is prioritized based on a series of, I think, 30 or 40 different factors that we look at. Uh, one of the main things we're concerned with always is the protection of usable quality water. Uh, we want to make sure that there's no chance for a well to leak and contaminate any of the water resources in the state. This one will probably take about two days because it's going to be it's going to be a fairly easy job once we've drilled through. Then what we'll do is we'll run steel tubing inside the well and we'll load the well bore with drilling mud all the way from bottom to top. Then we'll pump cement down the tubing which displaces the mud out the production casing so we can be sure that the cement's going where it's supposed to go. We'll spot approximately a hundred foot plug to cover the, any open perforations or towards the TD of the well. Then we'll come up and we'll do the same thing at different levels depending on what the rule requires and what our district circumstances are. It's an ongoing process. The Railroad Commission plugs several hundred wells every year. In our district alone for the last several years we've plugged over 100 wells each year. Uh, in times past we've plugged over 400 wells in a year. We've managed to protect a lot of water We've managed to remove a bunch of abandoned wells from the, from the landscape and to ensure that those resources are kept sacred for somebody to come in and drill them later.